to see on the camera, but there's like 11 planes over there. Taxied up in line to take off. Golly. It's a nice day today. Good morning. We are, today's Wednesday, last day of the conference, so, and I'm not showered or anything yet, so don't pay any attention to what you see here. Avert your eyes. Um, just got done breakfast. I've been waking up early every single morning, which is probably good that, I mean, I guess it's kind of sleeping in if you look at the time change, because when I get up at, I don't know, 7.30 or 8, here, it's really 9.30 or 10 at home, so that's no good. Hopefully next week won't be hard to, hopefully I won't adjust to this time zone and then go back there, because then it'll be, oh, really bad. Um, uh, getting up for work on Monday, so I don't know. It's gonna be a long day today. I am hopeful to spend the better part of the afternoon probably at the pool just lounging because um, it is sunny out today. Actually, I haven't checked the temperature. Um, let's see. I'm not sure what it is today. Oh, yeah, I mean by about 10 or 11, it's going to be in the 70s, and it's going to be as high today of 75. So that's a great temperature to be down there by that pool and um, sunshine the whole time, which is going to be great, especially this evening. There's no clouds in, in, the, in the forecast at all. So like right now, that's what we're at is 66, and in Fort Worth, Right now, they're at 90. Now, keep in mind, it's morning. Last night was funny because when I checked the uh, temperatures at 10 o'clock at night last night, it was 86 in Fort Worth, and here it was like 64. <laughs> so, it was funny. But anyways, um, I don't have any news. Okay, boys, this is a huge airplane, and I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to see that or even appreciate the size of it, but look at that airplane next to this smaller airplane. Where is it? Right there. And look at that one. Huge! Holy! That's really big. I wonder how many passengers that carries. Do you see that difference? Okay, there's a normal size airplane. There's that airplane, <laughs> it's huge. And there's San Francisco, oh yeah. Hello, husband. <laughs> All right, so we're eating, you have one up can't here. even see crepe vine. This is what the restaurant is looks like. Um, I ordered, let's see, what did I order? What did you order? Oh yeah, you ordered a burger. Let's see. Huh? So, I'm getting a club for Ben. Um, I ordered a club, Doug got a burger, and apparently I'm getting home potatoes because I didn't know any better. And the waitress, or the whoever's in there, the counter girl, she was so hard to hear. There were so many kids behind us, just yap, 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 yap. It was really hard to hear. So, hopefully it'll be good. We'll see, though. Um, I'll take a picture or I'll, I'll vlog it and I'll send it to you. Okay, so our food just came. Here is Doug's burger. Oh, look at the sourdough. It's on like a piece of bread like thing. It's fine. Um, anyways, there's, there's his and here's mine. I have a club sandwich and yum, it has avocado on it. Now, there was once upon a time when I would not want the avocado and that would have freaked me out and now I'm like, yum and I got some um, home fries with it. And there's my water, thank you. Thank you. Looks great, thanks. Anyways, there's our food. Yummy, hungry, mm-hmm, yep, looks good. Difference in the size of that dog. <laughs> Maybe I'll get him walking by. Aw.
little poodle just keeps uh, sniffing him. That, that dog's head is like up to here on the guy. I mean, he would be as tall as Ben. <laughs> That's so funny. Don't jiggle the tape. <laughs> He's so big. <laughs> He's big. <laughs> so we're back from Burlingame. We went in to eat, showed you our food. I'm going to end the vlog here because I'm full. I told Doug earlier I don't remember what it's like to ever be hungry. Like, I've been so full for so many days. Ugh. And I actually didn't even like pig pig out. I left a lot of my food on the plate, but whatever. Drive up a little further north to a less crowded Redwoods area near Guerneville. Yes. And then to South Salido. Oh, you're going blurry on me. Let me zoom in on your handsome face. There you are. Wow. <laughs> so, yeah, so that's the plan. Initially, we weren't going to rent a car. And because, okay, like, look. Okay, there's a little highway over there, but like over there where we would be driving to the city, the people, the traffic, the tourists, it's so intense, but Doug is confident he can just get on the highway, get on Golden Gate, and go north, and I have read that north isn't as bad as being congested in the city, but Sausalito and those kinds of places, Muir Woods, are terrible for parking. So we'll just have to play it by ear. And I have read, and you might want to read too, because um, I've heard that there are little towns that you can explore that are north of Sausalito that are just as beautiful and have beautiful views. And we might want to just... Is that what it's called? Yeah. Is that still Oceanside? Yeah. Well, come look. Oh, well, he's... Well, we can plan after I shut the vlog off. See, so here's... There's Golden Gate, there's Sausalito, but Tiburons are over there. And see, we're going to drive up the 101. Right. Are we? Well, actually, no. no we're going to drive up not. the 1. Yeah. Highway 1 up to... Uh, Somewhere in there. I think... Where was it? Was it this far north? Yeah, up, up to Guerneville. What was the little forest called? Because that wasn't Armstrong it. Armstrong Woods. Oh, yeah, Armstrong. Armstrong Redwoods Visitor Center. So is that like there's only the two Redwoods then? Is that what we're really wanting to see because they're huge? Yeah. Okay. It'll end up costing less because we won't have to pay for the bar and all that and the tour. And we won't have to risk Doug being stuck in the middle of a bus getting motion sick. We did buy some medicine for him just in case but I think that's what we'll do and I think it'll be fine to just kind of be in a car and in control a little bit because Friday and Saturday we're going to be at the mercy of other bus tours because we're going to do a hop on hop off city tour and that'll be fun though because it's a two day thing and we'll have two days to kill in the city and it'll be beautiful um, so I'm looking forward to tomorrow. I think it'll be fun and we'll see some beautiful nature and be able to hike some of this fat off my body. We need to detox so bad it isn't funny. <laughs> There's so much food here and when you're traveling that's part of the excursion is exploring what they have to eat. But ugh, I feel terrible. But that's okay because I can, I can fix it. Anyways, this is it. Um, tomorrow will be lots of fun and um, we'll sign off for now. I wish we had the dogs here to say goodnight, but we do not. So, goodnight. <laughs>